It was being called a hero's homecoming, but not by Corporal Kevin Holtree, the man whom the mayor, the chief of police, and fellow officers welcomed back to Boise after two months of rehab in Denver's Craig Hospital. Oh my goodness, I have butterflies. I'm so nervous. Like, I'll probably start crying. But... Meanwhile, on the other side of the terminal, well-wishers, friends, and those who feel like family wait for Kevin to come through these doors. We just want him to know that he is, he is our hero. Like, it's people, it's people like him that make the world a seriously better place. Tree Waters was just one of several dozen citizens of the city of Trees here because they were inspired by a formerly unfamiliar police officer. His positive attitude, I mean, think about what he's been through and he's not gonna let it take him down. Doyle Savelberg and his daughter Gianna came carrying a sign, others holding balloons. Here comes the honor guard. Look at this, all the police officers. Ladies and gentlemen! But all were hoping to fill Kevin's heart. Our American hero! Before this day, Kevin had some idea how his city felt about him, but he was still surprised by what he saw on the other side of the security doors. Since the shooting in November, Kevin says he always thought of himself as just being in the wrong place at the wrong time. This is not what I expected, so I'm a little overwhelmed. Perhaps, though, he was the right man to handle the circumstances he'd been handed. From going from where I was four months ago to here to being as, uh, as strong as I am now, um, I can't even really articulate it into words. People say, what's it like? But it's from almost getting killed to being here and uh, getting the support is. Kevin says it was the thought of Boise, getting back home, that kept him going in Denver. I knew that I needed to come back here and I needed to, uh, I'm still a father, right? I mean, I still have two daughters. I still have, I got a lot to do. I still have to be a cop. <laughs> so after 17 years on the force, Kevin isn't ready to call it quits on a career. And with his boss still calling the shots, I'm going to be the bad guy here. <laughs> so Kevin is ready to get back to his life, even if it's from a new perspective. Gianna, go ahead. Thank you. I love that sign. I appreciate it. Today's trip covered 638 miles from Denver to Boise, but it's obvious Corporal Kevin Holtry has come a lot farther than that in four months' time. Brian Holmes, Idaho's News Channel 7.